Sunday more and this is Self Care Sunday. I am going to show you my skincare routine. This routine I've been doing for 30 plus years. First thing I do is I start out with cool water. Never use hot water on your face. Never. Always use either lukewarm or cool water to cleanse your face. I dampen my face. Now mind you, I usually do this in the shower, so I'm gonna try to, I'm gonna make this work for video purposes. So the first thing I do is I dampen my face. And then I exfoliate. I have used the same product for over 30 years, okay? It's the same. If it ain't broke, don't fix it. I use St. Ives Fresh Skin Apricot Scrub. I take about a nickel's worth, a nickel size, and I scrub my face with it. Scrub. Exfoliation is important because it helps you to retain a youthful glow by getting rid of that layer of dry skin or flaky skin on your face. The only place I don't touch is below my eyes. I just go right above the cheek, right above the cheek, just under the chin, and my forehead. Yeah, stunning. I am going to rinse my face out in the sink and I'll be right back. Okay, so that's the rinse. I see I still have some exfoliant on my face. So I'm just going to get the rest of that off with a rag. Just get the rest of that off with a rag. And whatever else I missed. Okay. Now this, I don't do every single day. This um, this treatment I learned from my mom. So what she did, when my mom used to wash her face, I used to wash my mother, wash her face. And after she washed her face, she would take a lemon wedge and she would rub it all over. Yeah. Now I don't do this every single day. I do this um, maybe twice a week. Sometimes, a lot of times I forget to do it. But, you know, when I'm on point, I'll get it done twice a week. Now, this, because my face is so used to it, I don't get that burning sensation. I mean, it burns, it has a slight burning sensation, but uh, some people are really bothered by it. So what I would suggest if you do this process is to just take some lemon juice, Squirt some lemon juice in a in a little um, bowl or something, and add water to it, and then you can um, and then put it on your face. About a minute, I'll let it stay on, and then I will rinse it off with some cool water. I'm gonna go ahead and rinse, and I'll be right back. Okay, so I got my lemon done. Make sure there's no pulp on my face. So wipe that off. Okay, and then the last thing, my face is feeling so fresh and tingly. So the last thing that I do, again, like I said, I'm a creature of habit. I use the same, I've been using the same moisturizer on my face for years, 30 plus years as well. Because 
and I've tried new products and different products over the years, but they always break me out. So I just have to stick to what works. I grew up in New York City and I used to get my product, my, um, my moisturizer from 125th Street, from the vendors on 125th Street, and I'll pick up two. At back then it was two for five. Now I'm pretty sure the price went up. But what am I talking about? Shea butter. Yes. Shea butter is the truth for me. It works for me. Um, this is all I use. And I take a little bit. I always rub up. Forehead. My mom. <laughs> My mom, she taught me that you should never, she said you should never push your face, never rub your face down because then you look like this. She told me it's as a little girl. So, you know, I'm thinking as a little girl, oh my God, I don't want my face to look like this. So I always remember that. So I always rub my face up. Always. Always rub it up. I use my um, apricot scrub three to four times a week, okay? And I use my lemon wedge maybe twice a week. But I use my shea butter moisturizer every single day. All right, so that's it. Let me know if anything that I've done today, you'll try yourself. And if you do try it, make sure to come back and let me know how you liked it. Again, thank you so much for joining me on Self Care Sunday. This is AJ Moore signing out. And remember, stay safe and stay lifted.